everyone welcome back to the channel i'm going to bring to you today a flip through of this book now this isn't a new book but it's a new artist to me so i haven't actually got any books by tomislav tomic and i've really been seeing some gorgeous pages crop up on instagram and when i looked which book they're from they're always from these ones now as far as i'm aware there's two books um out at the minute if there's any more they're not on amazon uk because i've only spotted two on there um but there's this one which i'm gonna butcher the name of but it's spruik jibbles or something along those lines and then there's another one um i've really forgot the name it begins with a d Dro drug something or other anyway ignore me babbling on so i've been seeing these beautiful pages pop up and I was thinking maybe they're a little bit too detailed for me but then I thought that about the Circle of Life book and I purchased it and I've been colouring in it and I've been really really enjoying it so I thought go on I'll bite the bullet I'll get one of these books and we'll have a look and it is gorgeous I absolutely love it so it's a soft cover it is the same size as the Kirby Roseanne's Fragile World and all these other books same format um, same sort of thickness as well as the Kirby books so it is kind of similar so this is the name of the book here Thomas Love Tomic and this was released in 2018 um the other book that I've seen on Amazon was released in 2017 so this is the newest one as far as I'm aware if there's any others than not on Amazon um so cute little fairy on the front cover it's really smooth on the front as well really shiny and glossy glossy front cover so when we open it up, we've got the title page. The paper is really nice. It's like, it is like a cardstock. I don't know what pencils go down on this paper like, but it feels really nice. This is the Dutch edition that I have as well. So there's this cute little illustration here at the front, just a little one. And then these are what the images are like inside. Super cute little fairy. Lots of details in this book, but they look like they're manageable. They look like you could sit down and sort of pick little bits out and do maybe all the mushrooms, then something else, and just bit by bit. Most of these pages in this book are single-sided. There is a few that go into double page spreads that end up not being single-sided. So this one, for instance, um, because it's a double page uh, look at that can we get you all in that's a bit better look at that so sweet so so sweet is this a little clarinet or some sort of instrument i'm not good with my instrument names but some sort of not a clarinet a clarinet is a trumpet isn't it oh ignore me some sort of thing <laughs> so then we go back into single-sided images where it's on this side a cute little swan that one's not as detailed you've got your big image in the center and then just sort of your grasses in the background look at these little frogs popping the little heads up from the water so so cute anyway we'll do quite a fast flip through now but this is cute as well lots of fish on this if you want a prompt for colour and chat with sammy's colour fish page lots of fish on there and also a mermaid is she sort of another is this an eel i think it is this one's underwater treasure chest there this is beautiful there's quite a lot of space in the background to do something as well on that one quite a lot of space left again this goes into a double so beautiful gorgeous tree house somebody's colored this i've seen this colored i can't think who's i think it might have been shannon beautiful tree house anyway gorgeous gorgeous I really love it. I think it's really quirky and cute. I know it's a bit detailed, maybe too detailed for some, but this one, that's a large, really large image in the middle there. She's got a very long list of something. <laughs> so this is an awesome double page. Awesome. Big dragon. And just a dragon's head on this one. 
So it does seem to be dragons and fairies in this book and gnomes maybe i've seen a couple of gnomes i think i'm really impressed with the paper in it it seems really really i mean you can hear you can hear how thick that is it seems to be it's not a bright white it seems to be almost like a like an off white if you know what I mean gorgeous big sunflower who likes sunflowers another dragon I've seen this one coloured it looks stunning and if I remember rightly um, they used a colourful scheme for the trees so instead of just going with um, green they had like pinks and purples trees and it looked gorgeous I saw that on Instagram. That's one of the pages that made me get this book. Another sort of dragons. The furries riding the dragons. Oh, we've got some sort of tiger here. With wings. Look at that little dog down there. Look at the little dog. Yeah. He's flying a bird. And then, oh, how gorgeous is that double page? Oh my word. You know what? It doesn't look too bad either because we've got this massive image in the centre. And then we've got quite a lot of white space in the background. So the only really detailed, detailed parts on this page is the end sections here. But as for that, that is stunning. Stunning. This is a lot of leafage on this one. And then that's the end, and it says there, September 2018. Yeah, gorgeous, gorgeous book. I can't believe it's took me so long to get one. It just goes to show that there's always artists that you can come along that you've not found yet, whether it's on Etsy and it's an artist selling on Etsy, individual PDF pages, or whether it's a book you've not come across before. That's why... I find it's nice to do a flip. I mean, I know there's probably lots of flips of this book already on YouTube, but maybe you've not come across them because they've been posted years ago. Um, so this will pop up on um, your notifications and hopefully if you've not seen this artist and you like what you see, you'll go and buy it. And I may even do a colour along in this book. It might be in three parts because, you know, they are detailed. But if you, if you do want to see a colour along in this book, if you've got this book, drop me a comment down below. Thanks everyone for watching. Please do give this video a thumbs up and subscribe if you're new. See you again soon. Bye.